The blur option is a little bit hidden in Canva. So in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to blur photos and also how to blur backgrounds in your photos. Some of these techniques may require Canva Pro. You can try that for free in the link in the description. Let's get started. So I'm sure there's many reasons why someone might wanna blur a photo. If I just grab a photo from this elements section over here, or you upload your own, I'm gonna drag it onto the background. I'm guessing some of you might wanna use a photo as a background and have that a little bit blurrier because it's too sharp. So if we take this photo that's now in our background, any photo, you can go up to edit image. Once you're in the edit image mode, it looks like you only have three adjustments underneath adjustments, but really if you click see all, you get a bunch more and blur is one of those. So we can just up the blur and it's gonna start to blur out that photo. Now this does a very strong blur if you take it all the way to 100 and the inverse of this is actually sharpening. So you can sharpen a photo as well by kind of decreasing the blur if you will, but really it's sharpening or blurring of the photo. So that's how you would blur a photo and that adjustment stays there. So you can always go back in and readjust that. Now, if you wanna blur out a background of a photo, what you'll need to do is isolate your subject, duplicate the image, and then blur the background. So we're gonna take this image right here, and we're gonna isolate her and blur the background. First, we need two versions of this image. So I'm gonna copy and then paste. That's by right-clicking, copy, and then paste. So with this top image, we wanna isolate her to keep her in focus. So we'll go up to edit image, down to background remover. I do know this is only available in Canva Pro. Once it loads, it's gonna have her all isolated. So we'll take the background image now and we'll go back to adjust and we'll actually blur this background image a little bit. So now what we can do is take the front image, line it up with that background image, and she is still sharp, but the background is blurred. Now, once they're on top of each other, it's kind of hard to select the bottom most layer or bottom most picture. So if we select everything and then hold shift and click on the top photo, that will select the photo underneath. We can go back to edit image and not only can you blur the background, but you have the background isolated now. So we could do anything like we could drop the saturation, make the, black, the background black and white, and then leave the subject, the focal point of the photo in color. You can adjust the contrast, adjust the brightness levels, do the blur X process, add a vignette, anything like that to edit the photo in any way that you want. But this is how you would separate that subject from the background, blur out the background, or do any other adjustments you want. And that is how you blur photos and make adjustments to backgrounds of photos here in Canva.